The scene is set in uh, Lysander's bookstore, Shelf Indulgence, in the middle of the Chinatown market. A, the door chimes as a man ducks in and looks about. Uh, you, you'll, notice that, uh, you'll notice that a lot of the books are scattered al along the ground and the counter is broken into a few pieces and has been swept into a corner. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Did I make mess here? Oh, I'm, I'm always getting, knocking things down here. Is, oh, anybody around? Uh, just a second. Just a second. And start uh, picking up, begin picking up books and putting them on counters. Hello. Uh, just a minute. Just a minute. That's uh, under. Uh, puts his papers away and uh, comes down from an office upstairs. Uh, yes, hello? Uh, Dobrevice, M. Vasily. I'm looking for uh, Lysander. Are you... Is uh, he that's here? me. Uh, uh, yes, that's me. I, I received your letter earlier. Pleased to meet you. Uh, it's a pleasure. Reaches out Come to with me. take your hand. Come, we'll talk, we'll talk in my office. Okay, good. Uh, he leads you up a small, uh, follows a, a small flight of stairs to a small study-like area with a single desk with uh, three chairs and uh, an, ornately, uh, an ornately decorated sword hanging behind it on the wall. Please, have a seat. He squeezes into the room and squishes into the seat. Thank you for offer. Yeah, no problem. So, so uh, you did get letter. He's good. Yes, I did. Uh, I understand you want to make your haven in a uh, warehouse on the docks. Da. Okay. Uh, no. There are a few. There are a few conditions I have for that. Of course. Uh, any maintenance for that warehouse is up to you. Of course. Uh, in terms of funding, um, and just that you don't make any trouble. I mean, it's. As long as you uphold all the traditions there, it's not really an issue by me. No. Oh, one further thing. Uh, if our claim to this portion of the dock should ever come into question, I expect you to support Clan Bruja's claim to it. No, it's fine. I have supported Clan Bruja for a long time, so it's no problem. <laughs> Good to hear. Uh, to that regard, I have a letter for you from Bruja Primogen in Moscow. Moscow. Uh, I don't believe I've met the man. Uh, he, he opens up with a nearby letter opener. Yeah. Hmm. Excellent. Uh, I have a big set of them. I have to give to Bruja Primogen in every city. I do not know what they say, but I am asked to give to them. And I am old friends, so I give to all of them. Be yeah, assured, it's nothing <laughs> disparaging at all. It's more just to let me know who you are and nothing more. Okay. So, is good finally mutual? What is. Strange occupation for Bruja. Well, perhaps in modern nights, but uh, in ages past. Yeah, uh, I've been some before as well. Very happy meet one who is. Uh, this is very good. I think you and Vasily <laughs> will be good friends. So. Mm. I have good place set in dogs. I have brought family. Is okay. As long as they don't cause trouble. Uh, yeah, we'll do the Are they um, kindred? Mm, yep, I have my uh, the Kuchka and the Kusia, as well as uh, members of Rurek, my family. I see. Are they uh, kindred ghouls? What's the story? Mm. Roma. They are. Uh, uh, Rurek. 
is old Russian mob family. I see. I see. Well, so long as you don't uh, violate any traditions and so long as they don't cause any trouble, oh, no. it's not a problem by me. You're looking to cause the opposite of trouble. You're looking to set up business. So on and so forth. Uh, who controls docks themselves? Bruja, do you uh, control shipping in and out? No, the, the Bruja are on the, uh, the Venture are on the business interest. Our uh, influence is more with the, uh, the laborers, you understand. Yeah. And a little bit of real estate here and there. Yeah, understood. So, if a city wants to start a business in territory, how much would you be looking for cut? <laughs> you know, it's very rare that somebody asks me that question directly. Let's mm -hmm. say, uh, hmm, say ten percent, just enough so that I can consider my rent paid, and beyond that, ten percent. Ah, well, we would be paying for warehouse. Let us say five percent. We'll hmm. be paying taxes and warehouse duty fees if you control shipping. We will be doing lots of shipping. You will be getting duty fees. I'm already eating into the city's profit. All right, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. You make it uh, 10%. You don't have to pay rent on the warehouse. And should you have any trouble with the dockside unions, I will lend my support. Yeah. <sighs> pulls out a notepad and starts writing in Russian. If you want to read it, if you have Russian. Uh, I might be able to put a little bit together. Okay. Mm. No, I can't read that, actually. <laughs> okay. Uh, very good. I think we can do business, Lysander. Excellent. Goes to a spits in his hand and holds it out. <laughs> ah, I'm hoping we'll be start of good friendship. Let's hope so. Come drinking with Vasily. When is good time? I'll consider it. Uh, let me write down my number for you in case you need to contact me. Uh, if you are looking for books. Vasily can call family back in old country, see if they have any thing of interest. Would you like? I'll take that and I'll, I'll keep that in consideration. Um, he hands you a piece of paper with his number on it. Feel free to drop by any time. Mm, but he takes it and puts it in his pocket. Uh, well, you know where Vasily will be staying, so he's no problem there. Hmm. Oh, one other thing. Uh, no. It would be helpful if you were to check in either in person or by phone at least once a month, just to make sure you know nobody goes missing on my domain. Looks bad. Mm. Well, Vasily will be checking in more than once a month. Vasily Excellent. will be calling you at least once a week. <laughs> You're going to be good friends, Lysander. Nah. I do hope so. A bit more and accidentally knocks some books on your desk and they <laughs> shuffle a bit. Oh, excuse, excuse you. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Well, perhaps you will need to come to Vasily's. Lovely house, but it is too small. <laughs> oh. Yes, well, as it stands, well, I don't really have the uh, funds to make a bigger haven. Mm, well. Besides, this suits me just fine. Uh, silly, we'll see what the, I can do about that. Well, no. we should don't worry yourself. Lysander? Yes, um, have a good night. I will, I will call you later. We will share good drink, tell stories. <laughs> got plenty of those. Mm. Nah, silly does as well. And it's good. Perhaps you can tell better stories than any of the younger Bruja kicking about. I, I find the trouble with their stories is it's all about uh, violence and such. There's no 
stake to it, you know what I mean? Да, he's all knights and dragons with no dragons. Exactly. Uh, anyway, I do have business to attend this evening, so if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, myself as well. Thank, Thank you. you, Lysander, and Dobrovici. Have a good evening. Hello.